Uh, good morning, class. Good morning, dear teacher Anthony. How are you? We are all right, thank you, dear teacher Anthony. Is everybody okay? Yes. If you are happy, Andy, no, clap your hand. If you are happy, Auntie, no, clap your hand. If you are happy, Auntie, no, Auntie really want to sew. If you are happy, Auntie, no, sit down. <laughs> oh, okay. Now, today, I have brought something so interesting for you. Something so what? Interesting. But I need only, only those ones who are going to be so active, attentive to me, and the ones who are going to enjoy what I've brought for you. All together? Yeah. Now, let me tell you one story why I love science, why I have become a science teacher. Because science talks about what is in my body and what is in my environment. Is that not interesting? Yeah. Now, in our, in, in our environment, we have... Uh, basically two groups of things. We have living things and we have non-living things. Uh -huh. Now under uh, living things we have things like, uh, uh -huh. let's have hands, yes, animals. animals, very good, yes we have, we have people and animals, yes, we have plants, and then there are very many, but those ones which we see physical are like plants and animals now today i have chosen to come with something about plant life everybody plant life plant life plant life plant life plant life yes have you ever known that the plants also have life yes yes plants do have life they live they even die at a certain period of time they are like us how together yes. now under plant life we are going to look at very fast we talk about Types of plants. We talk about what? Types of plants. We talk about types of plants. Ah, now, because the plants are in our environment, I know you might have seen or noticed some parts of plants. How to, I mean, types of plants, eh? How together? Now, can we mention for me the types of plants? Types of plants. Yes, Sandy? Flowering. Very good one. Somebody says flowering plants. Can you clap that boy, Sandy? Great boy, flowering plants. plants. We have flowering plants. Mm, I have Fiona. Non flowering plants. Very good. We have non flowering plants. We have non flowering plants. Non flowering plants. plants. Non flowering plants. Now, let us start with this one called non flowering plants. We have said there are flowering plants and non flowering plants as our types of. Plants. Now let us look at this non. Let me start with this down one called non, non flowering, non flowering plants. Now what are these non flowering plants? What are these non flowering plants? I don't need me, teacher. I just want to see you putting up your hand. Yes, sweetie. Non-flowering plants are plants which do not bear flowers. It's okay. Yes. Can we all repeat what you have said? Non-flowering plants are plants which do not bear flowers. They are plants which do not bear flowers. All together, yes. we have some plants that bear flowers and those ones which do not bear flowers are called non-flowering plants. We say non-flowering plants, non-flowering Plants are plants are what? Plants. Which which do what? Which do which do not bear flowers? Which do not bear flowers? Which do not bear what? Flowers. Now these plants do not bear flowers, and yet we say uh, I mean a flower is. A reproductive part of a plant. Do you think these plants reproduce or do they, they do not? They reproduce. they reproduce, not so. Now we are going to again group them according to their way of reproducing. Are we there? Yes. Huh? Yes. yes, we say now we say groups of we look at groups, groups of non flowering, non flowering what? Plants, groups of non flowering plants. We have the groups of non flowering plants. Yes, I need somebody. Yes, please. 
we have fungi. It's okay. We are still looking at the groups. Huh? Yes, please. Spore producing plants. Very good, girl. We have spore producing. Spore producing plants. These are nine flowering plants that are produced by means of what? Spores. We say spore producing plants. They are nine flowering plants which reproduce by means of uh, spores. Are we there? Yeah. Everybody, what are, none, what, what are spore producing plants? Spore producing plants are plants which produce by means of spores. Yes, we say spore producing plants. Spore producing plants are plants. Are what? Plants. plants which which reproduce by means of by means of what spores. by means of spores by means of uh, spores. spores these plants reproduce by means of what spores now we are going to look at examples of these plants these poor producing plants we see now examples we look at examples of spore producing plants. Examples of spore producing plants. Uh-huh. Yes. Examples. Mention from yes, please, my boy. Oh no, you have tried, but I like that trial. Yes, please. Mushrooms. We have mushrooms. Are mushrooms plants? No. Are mushrooms plants? They are not the plants. Somebody give me a reason for that. Let us first clear that off. Yes? They do not have chlorophyll altogether. Yes. Huh? They do not have chlorophyll. Have you ever seen the roots of mushrooms? No. no. Have you ever seen them having leaves? No. They don't have leaves. They don't have roots. They, therefore, they are not plants altogether. They belong to fungi. They belong to what? Fungi. Now, let us look at examples of spa producing plants. Yes, please. We have Moses, very good boy. We have uh, everybody Moses. 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 Can somebody spell for us the word Moses? One person. I, I need only one person. Yes, please. Moses. Yeah. M O S S. -S. Uh -huh. Can we say everybody? Moses. Yes. M O S S E S. Now Moses. I have come here. I remember I came here with a Moses. We are going to look at the Moses. That non flowering plant that reproduces by means of uh, spores. I'm going to take it on your desk. Just be there, Moses. And you tell me where you have ever seen them. All together. I'm going to take them there to you. You show me where you have ever seen them. Don't make noise. Our Moses. Our Moses. That is Moses. That is what? Moses. That is Moses. Yes, now you have seen Moses. That is a non flowering plant. It does not bear flowers. All together? It does not bear what? Flowers. Flowers. But it has its way of reproducing. That is by spores. Where have you ever seen this Moses? Yes, please. Princess. At home, yes. Come on in which places, yes? I have ever seen Moses beside the wall of our house. Very good, beside the walls of their house, yes? On verandas. On verandas. Come on, on verandas. Okay, mainly on verandas, on places where water runs all together. Yes. On places where water flows, the, flow, the rain water flows. That's where they mainly develop. Uh huh. We have Moses. We have another one. Yes, please. Liverworts, very good. We have another one called Liverworts. Everybody, Liverworts. 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 Can we spell the word Liverworts? Liverworts. Yes. L-I-V-E-R-W-O-R-T-S. Very good. Uh -huh. We have another one. We have? Fans. We have fans. We have the fans. Everybody, fans. 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 Uh huh. Can we spell the word fans? Fans. Yes. F E R A N S. 
Uh huh. Yes, please. We have the conifers. Conifers, we are going to look at them and the stony grove. Uh huh. We have one remaining. Who will take that, that privilege of being a king? If you tell me the answer, the last one, you'll be crowned a king. King of the science in this place. Ah, uh, king of science. Let me get king of the, I mean the queen of the science. King or the queen? Huh? Who wants to be the queen or the king? Yes, please. Austin's, uh huh, you have tried. Uh huh. Water high things. Oh, you have tried. Good trial. Okay. Have you all? Yes. We have fun. No, we have another one called. It. I need somebody to pronounce that word. Algae. Algae. It's called what? Algae. Everybody, algae. 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 Spell the word algae. Algae. Uh huh. Good. Okay. That is what? Okay. Now we come to the next group of non-flowering plants. We look at spore-producing plants. They reproduce by means of spores. We come to the next group. Uh -huh. Yes, Fiona? Conifers. We have the conifers. We have the conifers. Everybody, conifers. 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 People call them coniferous plants. They call them what? Coniferous plants. Coniferous plants. plants. Coniferous plants. Now, looking at the coniferous plants, these are non flowering plants that reproduce by means of seeds. Everybody, what are conifers? Conifers are plants that reproduce by means of seeds. Conifers are non flowering plants that reproduce by means of seeds. They are non flowering plants that reproduce by means of what? The word conifer comes from the word corn. Comes from the word what? Corn. corn. The word is called corn. It is called it? Corn. corn. They bear, they keep their seeds in the corn. Now, I'm going to show for you one. This is a corn of one of the conifer. This is one of the coniferous plant. The corn. Seeds are inside. This is still the young one. The younger corn. How together? This is the younger? Corn. This is the younger corn. Now you will show me, you will tell me from which plant I've ever seen this one, this corn, something like this. Hmm? From which plant is that? Yes, hello. Eh, you have forgotten? Huh? Yes, Gloria? Pine. Very good girl. She has ever seen this one from a pine. How together? She has ever seen this one from what? A pine, these ones are mainly from pines. So pines are the first example of conifers. How together? Pines are example of what? Conifers. Conifers. Now, let us first define conifers. We say, uh-huh, we say conifers are non-flowering flowering plants which reproduce which it produce by means of seeds. By means of seeds. By means of what? Seeds. Uh -huh. We say they, they keep their seeds in the corn. They keep their seeds in the what? They keep their seeds in the corn. Say they keep, they keep their seeds, they keep their seeds in the corn. In the what? Corn. In the corn. Conifers keep their seed in the corn. This is a corn. This is the part where the conifers keep their seeds. Now let's look at the examples. Examples. We say examples. Examples of what? Conifers. Conifers or coniferous plants. Coniferous plants. Examples of coniferous plants. Examples of coniferous plants. We said one, Sandy? Pine. We have pine. Somebody said the pine. Somebody say that she saw this thing from a pine, not so? So one of the examples is our pine. Our pine. Another one. Huh? Only the same people? Yes, please. Joy? Strawberries. We have strawberries. No. 
Uh -huh. No, don't laugh at your friend. That's good. I like people who try. Strawberries are not, please. They bear flowers. All together? Yes? We have coconut. Somebody say coconuts. Coconuts bear that. Hello. We have fur. We have what? Everybody fur. 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 Can you spell the word fur? Fur. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. We have the next one called cedar. Everybody cedar. 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 Uh huh. Spell the word cedar. Cedar. Yes. C E D A R. Cedar. Uh huh. Now we have the last one called podo. 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 Uh huh. Spell the word podo. Uh huh. Now, these plants, these conifers, are very important for us in the environment. They are very important. Huh? They are very, very important. First of all, the decks you are sitting on. The decks you are sitting on. These timbers are made from, uh, uh, from pines. All together. Pines help to produce soft wood, used for producing it or uh, making furniture. All together. Yes. Pines. The conifers like the pines help to produce soft timbers used for making furniture. How together? Yes. Uh, we say now when somebody asks you economic, we say economic values, economic values of conifers. Economic values of what? Conifers. Conifers. You say what do you say? What do you say? What do you say? We say I said conifers produce soft Timber used for making furniture. How together? Yeah. Uh huh. We say conifers. Conifers produce. Produce what? Soft. Soft wood or soft, soft timber used. Used for making furniture. furniture. Most of our furniture are made from the soft timber, got from uh, conifers. All together? Yes. yes. Uh -huh. Now we go to. Now these are non flowering plants. Non flowering what? Plants. Today we shall not go into details about them. Yes. Now uh, let us go to another group of plants called flowering, flowering plants. We are looking at it. At the beginning of the lesson, somebody told us that there are two types of plants. One was the flowering plants and the non-flowering plants. So we have looked at non-flowering plants. So we are starting with the flowering. Yeah. We are starting with the what? Flowering plants. Flowering plants. Flowering plants. Now, I need somebody to define for us. What is a flowering plant? Huh? Chamel? Huh? Be loud so that others hear. Uh -huh. Can we repeat what she has said? Flowering plants are plants that bear flowers. So, flowering plants are plants that bear flowers. You say, flowering plants. Flowering plants are plants are plants that bear Can we read that everybody again? Flowering plants are plants that bear flowers. Close your eyes and recite for me. Boys alone. Flowering plants are plants that bear flowers. Girls. Flowering plants are plants that bear flowers. Now, under flowering plants, can we first mention some of the examples of flowering plants that you have ever seen in the environment? Uh huh. Some flowering plants that you have ever seen around. Yes, my friend. Pardon? Mango. mango. We have mango. Ah, uh, yes, Fiona. Orange. We have the orange. Yes, please. Beans. We have the beans. Uh-huh. Who else? Where are the boys? Yes, yeah. please, my friend. Sweet 
Uh, sweet potatoes, yes, please. They the coffee, oats, and so on. There are very many examples of flowering plants. There are very many examples of what? Flowering plants. Flowering plants. Now, we are going to have question. Uh huh. So say, release the N for examples of flowering flowering what? Plants. plants. List any examples of flowering plants. flowering plants. In your in your environment. Any four examples of flowering plants in your environment. You will do that for me. You will do that. Uh-huh. You are going to write them in your box and I'll mark them. Okay, let's go ahead. That is your, you leave the space for it and write for me the answers there. Ah, uh, something here, we are looking, we are going straight away to structure. We shall have the structure, the structure of a flowering plant. We have the structure of a flowering. Are we there? Yeah. Everybody can you read what I've written there? The structure? Structure of a flowering plant. Yes, we have structure of a flowering plant. Structure of a flowering what? Structure of a flowering plant. Now, Now, I have come here with a structure, with a structure of a flowering plant, all together. Now, we are going to look at the parts, parts of flowering plants. We are going to look at the parts of this flowering plant. Okay, looking at the past of these flowering plants, huh? there are very many there. We are going to look at them, to read them one by one. From there, I'll give you an activity to do, very simple activity. All together, yeah, I want to see those who have been attentive throughout the lesson. Uh -huh. Can everybody first get up? Get up, everybody. Get up, everybody. Clap once, twice. Say, I love science. I love science. I love science. Science is my subject. Science is my subject. I love science. I love science. Good, good children. Good teacher. Okay, sit down, sit down, everybody. Uh huh. We are going to look at this following type. I mean, parts of flowering plants. Flowering plants. We have the first part up here called it? Flower. Everybody? Flower. 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 Can we spell the word flower? Flower. Uh-huh. F-L-O-W-E-R. Flower. Uh-huh. We come to our next part. After flower we have? Fruit. We have the fruit. Everybody fruit. 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 Uh-huh. Can we spell the word fruit? Uh-huh. Again? F-R-U-I-T. Uh -huh. We have a part called internod. Internode. 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 Uh -huh. Can you spell the word internode? Internode. Uh -huh. I-N-T-E-R-N-O-D-E. Good. Uh -huh. This side is still, we have the stem. 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 The, the word stem? Stem. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Down here we have taproot. 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 Uh -huh. taproot. taproot. 
Uh -huh. Good. Aha, uh -huh, we go the other side. All together? Yes. We have part called nod. 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 Spell the word nod. Nod. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. The next word is? Bird. Bird, uh-huh. Bird. Uh. Bird. The next word is? Leaf. Spell the word leaf. Leaf. L-E-A-F. Leaf. Now. From those words, we have flowering plant has two systems. Flowering plant has two what? Systems. systems. There are two systems. I'm not going to tell you, I just want to tell me. Yes, Joy? We have suit system. Now, I need somebody to come and touch for me where the suit system begins and where it ends. Yes, we have. Yes, Rebecca. Come on, ask for us where the suit is. Please. The suit system starts from down here, from where the ground stops and goes upward. All together? Yes. From where the ground starts here, going upward. Now, let us mention parts that makes up the suit system. Parts that make up the suit system. I don't need more teacher. Yes, please. We have one is the leaf. Uh huh. Flower. We have the flower. We have the fruit. We have the stem. Yellow. We have the nod. The nod. Uh huh. Lastly, branch. we have the branch. Yes. Internode. We have the internode. Is there? Is there any many? Yes. yes. Hello. We have top root. Is it that the root system? Top root is in the soil. Uh huh. We have the stem. And then well, let's go to the next system of flowering plants. Next system of flowering plants. Yes, my friend. We have what is called root system. We have root what? Eh? System. Let me call, let me get somewhere to come and touch for us. Where the root system is. Touch for us where it begins and where it ends. Uh-huh. It begins from up, where the soil starts going down one. The part of a plant that is in the soil, here, is called root? System. It is called root what? System. Root system. Now, I'm going to remove off that. I'm going to remove off. Yeah. And then I, I want people to come. I, we have our plant there. I want people to come and... I will call a person. You come. You get for us a word. I have my words here. This is my word bank. I have the word bank. You get for me a word. You read it for us. You spell it. And you go and pin it where the part is. Sorry. Wait. Wait. Okay, that is my plan, my life plan. Now we have been looking at the parts of flowering plant. Now we shall get a person. You come and pick for us a word. After picking the word, you spell it. Huh? You read it and spell it. Go and put it there. Uh huh. I'm cheating for you. Yes. We have, first of all, yes, Joy, come. Come on. My words. Pick a word. Uh huh. So them. A L O W E R. The word is flower. Uh huh. Put for us the flower where it is. Is it alright? Is it okay? Yes. Is that where our flower is? Yes. Yes. That's our where our flower is. But when we do it like that, we shall cover other parts. So this is how we are going to do it. 
This is our flower. Uh huh. The next part. The next person. We had a girl. I'm going for a boy. I'm go yes, Joseph. Come on. Come, come. Kenneth, come. Get for us one word here. I'm mixing them. Okay. So for them, is it, is it stem? Is it true? Yes. Yes, go and put for us the stem where it is. <laughs> is he correct? Yes. Can we give him flowers? <laughs> Good. We need another person. Yes, Siri. Siri, come. Uh huh. You all come here, please. Don't worry. You all come here. I remember telling you, you will enjoy all. Those who are attentive will enjoy and like what is here. No. N-E-O-D-E. Aha, uh -huh. so for them. So them. Is that the nod? Aha. Uh -huh. Put where the nod is. Is it correct? Yes. Is it correct? Yes. This is the way she has put her thing is facing here. This is the node out together. Yes. Huh? We have the node, the leaf here that developed here from the node has got plucked off. So we have here the node. Uh-huh. Uh, can we give her soda? Good. Uh, we have the next person, next person, next person. Gloria. Gloria, from there we shall go to a boy, please. Okay, Gloria. Uh huh. Get for us word. The word is called. Uh huh. F R U I T. Is it correct? Yes. Yes. Okay. This is our. These are our fruits. Our fruits are here. Uh huh. Go. A boy, a boy, a boy. Yes, Sandy. Oh, hello. Yes. Leaf. O e f. Leaf. Is he correct? Yes. Yes, that's a leaf. Give him what? Give him flowers at least. Okay, now uh, our next person. Remember, we picked two girls. This time, we are going to pick another boy. Another boy. Yes, Geoffrey, come on. Uh huh. We we'll mix the words. Pick it. Okay. Okay. Now go on. Good, uh-huh. Is he correct? Yes. Yes. Uh-huh. Can we clap him? Good. Uh-huh. Next person. Next person. Girl. Next person. Next person. I'm going to pick at a random. I'm going to pick at a random. Hello. <laughs> hey, come, 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 come. Come and get for us word here. Make a pick for us word. Peace. Pick the word. Okay. Pick the word. Read it for us. Spell it. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Put it where it is supposed to be. Where does he put it? Is it correct? Yes. Really? Yes. Uh -huh. Come and show for us. Come and elaborate for us. Which part exactly is that she has put? From where to where? Oh, is it correct? No. Now, let's talk about internet. 
does somebody know about internet? Anything about internet? Huh? What makes it know that this is the internet? Hmm? We say an internet is a distance between one node and another. Distance between one node and what? Another. One node and another. We have our one node is here and another node is here all together. So the distance between this node and this one here. This one and this one is called inter. The distance between this node and this one is called what? Inter. Inter node. Please, we shall put our thing here properly so that our viewers can see it very well. And how we have the distance between one node, this node and this one is called internode. Everybody, internode. Internode. Yes, uh huh. We get one boy. Yes, Mukisa. Hello. Girl will come last. We shall finish with a girl. Uh huh, yes. So them the roots. So them the word. Uh huh. Is it correct? Yes. Yes. Uh huh. Has he put where the roots are? Yes. Uh huh. Very good. Those are the roots. Uh huh. Lastly. 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 The chance is going to go to ah. Uh. <laughs> Yes, uh -huh. the chance has come to you. Uh -huh. Our word is here. We are remaining with one word and see the one finishing it. Yes. We have our word, bad. Uh -huh. I mean, put where the bad is. Our uh, oh, we have not seen properly. Huh? Somebody come and suffer the bad. Yes, please come. Come and put where. It is the point where the bad is exactly. We have many parts there. Okay, look for it for this side, that side. Is it okay? Is that our bird? Yes, you're not seeing. Come on, touch for us the bird you mean. Oh, that one. Is there a bird there? Eh? Okay, now somebody come and correct it for us. Yes, please, my friend. Go and so for us the bird. Okay, this is our bird. This is our what? Okay, now that is the part of flowering plants. Now uh, we are going to the questions. I want to know those who have been attentive throughout the lesson. Uh huh. What are flowering plants? Yes, what are flowering plants? Yes, please. Very good. Flowering plants are plants which bear flowers. Flowering plants are plants that bear what? Flowers. Uh huh. We say, uh, apart from flowering plants, give any other, other types of plants. Yes, please. We have non flowering plants. Groups of non flowering plants. Yes. We have the conifers. We have spore producing plants. Examples of spore producing plants? Mosses. Yes. Fern. Yes. Okay, thank you. Uh, we are going to write, I will give you, I'll give you the papers for the activity. You copy them and answer and collect your books for marking. Are we okay? Yes. Yes. Uh, dear viewers, thank you for being with us. That has been our lesson. For me, that's it. That has been our lesson about flowering plants. Uh, things that we need to have when we end in class, we should make sure that we bring a lot of learning aids to the children to aid their learning, to make sure that they understand. Like, you have seen my children. Because I came with a lot of learning aids, they have grabbed the content and they are very happy. 
throughout the con uh, le lesson. Thank you so much for viewing. Love you. Meet next time. Next time we're beginning from importance of this part of flowering plants. Goodbye. And may God bless you too.